All right, so I want to do this as a kind of a let's play video because I don't really do a whole lot of those. So I uh, so today in the mail I got a uh, Atari CX22 trackball, <laughs> and I have to admit, games that used a trackball like Missile Command and Crystal Castle Centipede. It's it really is like bringing the arcade experience home now, and it's it it, it blows my mind. Um, how I managed all these years to play without a trackball, and so while a lot of the games don't have built-in native trackball support, it still works pretty damn well. So we're gonna play track. We're gonna play the 7800 version of Centipede using a, a using an Atari CX22 trackball. Um, let's, uh, let's see how I do. There we go. Seriously? I hate those stupid spiders. This is not going very well for me tonight. Yeah, I don't say much when I play and everything because mostly because I'm just trying to keep my focus. So, you know, try not to be rude here, guys. Well, <laughs> not the greatest run in the world. I mean, of course, playing with a trackball is still taking me a little bit of getting used to, but I got to admit, it does feel more like actually playing the arcade version of Centipede, which I have not played in ages. I probably haven't played the arcade version of Centipede in probably about, oh, 20 years. Um, so I just wanted to kind of showcase this, whatever, and just like, it really does... It really does make a difference. Um, I mean, I really can't stress this enough. You can find one of these on like eBay or Amazon or something, and you don't have one. I really recommend picking one up and everything. I was playing a little bit of Crystal Castles earlier. I was playing a little bit of uh, Missile Command earlier, and it does. It makes a tremendous difference, especially playing Missile Command. Um, you know, what? I could probably real quick and everything, you know, run through Crystal Castles. Admittedly, I'm not very good at Crystal Castles. But, you know, just so I can just kind of show off real quick and show what the, uh, 
what the trackball can do here as well. Uh, let me just switch this out here real quick. All right, we'll just do a little crystal castles here real quick. And like I said, you just with the, especially with the trackball, you just you can move around in this game so much easier than trying to play it with a joystick. And now, mind you, these games don't have native trackball support for the you know 2600 games. So this, I'm running the CX-22 in joystick mode, but it does make a tremendous difference on how easily you can move around. Yeah, and like I said, I'm again, I'm not very good at this game either, but. I'm trapped. I was crap. I was hoping. Oh, I lucked out there. I forgot you could actually jump in this game. Oh, if I remembered that and everything, I probably could have avoided some of these traps. Ah, well. Anyway. Like I said, the CX-22, fantastic. If you can get your hands on one, I highly recommend doing so. Anyway, so that's this little video here. Um, I hope you guys enjoy. Have a good one. Happy gaming.